What's up you guys, Eddie at Fliptronics. We're gonna be checking out the best leather case to be using with the iPhone XR. All right, so I've got the Mujo right here. This is a genuine leather case. The design on this one is ridiculously nice. Now, I have a link in the description if you want to check it out on Amazon. Um, I want to go over the packaging before I actually take it out, and uh, you know, I want to get to the back real quick. So, I actually had a chance to grab a couple of these with the iPhone XS Max um, sometime last year. So, you know, I thought it'd be a good idea to maybe grab one for the iPhone XR. So, you know, uh, this is a reputable company. You know, they've gotten some good reviews from iMore and Cult of Mac, which is you know a couple really high traffic blogs for uh, you know iPhones. so anyways um, one person said this is how a leather wallet case should be um, and the other one says you know looks terrific blah 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 we get it but anyways the reason that I love these Mujo cases is because they're just really nice I mean there's no other way around it and the other thing um, if you're you know looking for a leather case uh, you know you always want to go with genuine leather because they last a lot longer than synthetic and um, you know, they'll likely last as long as you have your phone. So if you have an iPhone XR right now, two years down the road, you're still gonna be using your Mujo case. It'll still be, you know, uh, well put together. It's not gonna be falling apart as opposed to a synthetic leather case. So that's really the difference. Um, so anyways, this case right now, um, it sells for a little bit more like around $50 currently, but like I said, it's gonna last a long time, so you will get your money's worth on it. It's got about 24 reviews. Um, looks like it's an Amazon uh, top choice right now, and you can get it in a few different colors. I wanna go over that, so you can get it in tan. I got the olive right here. I thought olive would be kind of a cool look because, you know, uh, it's not like your typical uh, leather color, so, um, and then they've got blue or black. Um, so anyways, normally I would go with like a tan or a black leather, but we went with the olive on this one because, you know, I just thought it'd be kind of cool to check out, uh, you know, this color. So anyways, let's get out of the packaging. Obviously, really nice packaging here. Um, this is the case. They've got kind of like a little intro to it. And then, uh, you know, we're gonna get it out of here. So it actually does come with a um, little uh, welcome card. I took it out already, but it just says, uh, you know, Mujo. And then it's just got a little, um, you know, kind of like certificate of authenticity, you know, that you bought it from them. All right, so let's go over this case. All right, so first of all, you know, the genuine leather feels really nice, obviously. On the inside here, look at that, look at that nice suede. So this is a suede feel right here. This is real suede. Then you've got the Mujo branding right here as well. Um, the case itself, you know, it's not very heavy at all. So it's not gonna be really bulky like a uh, your typical wallet case. You can get about three cards in here. Um, that's what I've, I've experienced, uh, you know, in the past when I've used your cases. So you can throw three cards in here to take with you when you're on the go. So, I mean, this is, uh, like a really nice case for, you know, the weekend. So if you don't want to take your entire wallet with you, you can throw some cards in here. You could even throw a little bit of cash in here if you want. Um, you could also use it as a daily case. So uh, if you don't want to take all your personals with you in your wallet, you could throw them in here for work. It's good for, you know, if you're going shopping. But the idea here is that, uh, you know, it's a nice fashionable looking case. Now I've got a red iPhone XR obviously, so it's gonna look, you know, kind of interesting, right? So there it is. Uh, let's get a quick look at it. Let me, um throw their little card in here so let's just get a look here so I mean that's basically the look of this case as far as protection it does a pretty good job it's got a little bit of a front raised lip on it so it will give you a little bit of protection it's not going to be super protective this is more of like a fashionable case but still gets the job done uh, we'll take a look at the front of it with the you know this going here all right let's put it down for a second here all right anyways um, yeah I mean I love these cases all right, uh, I'm gonna take this card out, and uh, you know, if you have any questions um, about using uh, this one, you can just hit me up below in the comments. I will get back to you. But you know, you can expect to get about three cards in here. Um, genuine leather cases are definitely the way to go if you're looking for uh, getting a leather case because, like I said, they're gonna last a long time. I've been loving these Mujos. Um, I'll throw a link down there as well if you want to check out some of the. Um, iPhone XS Max uh, videos we did with the Mujo cases sometime, you know, last year, but I still have them. I'm still using them, and I thought it was a good time to pick one up for the iPhone XR. All right, I'll have a link down there as well if you want to check this one out on Amazon. Feel free to message me. Thanks for watching this, and we'll see you guys later.